Come on. Any time now. Oh, John. Thanks for coming. Bill, it's seven o'clock in the morning. Last time you said I'd come over at this time, your house would be on fire. And it's not. Don't care. Come on, I gotta show you something. Go on, take a seat. So this is what I wanted to show you. Ta-da! Bill, this is why you still live in your parents' basement. No! I live in my parents' basement because they think I'm too immature to live in the outside world. Yeah. Wonder why. Anyways, a piece of cardboard and strips of duct tape. No, not at all. This is a... I don't care if it's a machine that can transport people through time and space. But that's what it is, actually. I can prove it. For instance, how did you get up this morning? Oh, I don't know. I'm too tired. In fact, how did I even know to come here? Because I told you to. But I didn't do it yet. I should do it now. John, you need to wake up now and get to my house by seven. Thanks for listening. I just went back in time, woke you up, and told you where to go in the morning. With this new time machine, we can go anywhere. We can even stop the Kennedy assassination. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on a second. Don't you think maybe we should do some tests first so it doesn't, like, warp the time stream or something? Time stream? I'm way too full of myself to do stuff like tests. And if you're not going to somehow say President Kennedy, I am. See ya. Kennedy, stop!